it's a great day for a drive, especially in this 2016 F-150 Lariat in ruby red metallic, black leather interior, seating for five, four doors and a five and a half foot box. It has a 3.5 liter V6 engine. It's paired with an automatic transmission and it's a four by four. It also has a moonroof, navigation, reverse camera, heated and cooled seats, and you've also got a trailer tow package, which includes an integrated trailer brake controller. It's really easy to get into this vehicle. Just talk to our sales team. You can take it out on a test drive and book it online at islandford.ca. Stay tuned, we're gonna have a look under the hood and inside and out. 3.5 liter V6 engine. It's paired with an automatic transmission and it's a four x four. Let's have a look inside. Speaker in the door as well as power locks, windows and mirrors. There's also memory for three drivers and the driver's seat is powered with lumbar. Your power pedals are located here. Lighting controls, LED side view mirror spotlights, power, tilt and telescoping steering wheel, and the aid of your running board and grab handle. Super easy to get in. On the face of the steering wheel is your dash controls, adaptive cruise control, media with volume, and hands-free dialing. And this is a push start. So my foot's on the brake, keys in the pocket, and we're gonna push the engine start stop button. On your dash, any important messages will appear and you have menus that you can go through. So right now it's in trip fuel. I'm gonna start at the beginning. My view, then trip fuel, truck info, towing, off-road settings, and these all have sub-menus. In the center, you're seeing the Sony branding and you've got a little bin, traction control. You also have your hazard lights and there's your 360 camera. And it shows you where you are in space and then the view off the back there. And then you have the different views, heated steering wheel. And we also have the dual climate control for driver and passenger. If we go into audio and it's just a touch of each of the buttons, we can go into the sources, AM, FM, Sirius satellite radio, CD and Bluetooth. You've got navigation, so your map's gonna come up. And when you put the vehicle in reverse, you're gonna see your backup camera view. And there it is again. The white lines are as I turn the steering wheel, the direction I'm going, and green, yellow, red is how close I'm getting to things. And then we can go back in. Let's go back to home. And that screen will come up. We've got our settings. You can slide through. There's Bluetooth, Wi-Fi. You can change the look of your display. You have ambient lighting and so forth. Volume and tuner. There's your CD player, dual climate control, heated and cooled seats for both driver and passenger. There are fans in the center, AC and max AC, as well as your front and rear defrost. And down in the cubby, there's a 12 volt and a couple of USB outlets. And you can just press it in the center. It'll close right up. 4x4 with locking differential, pro trailer backup and integrated trailer brake controller. You have a select shift automatic shifter and then you have tow haul and sport. When you press it, it'll appear to the left of the odometer reading. There's tow haul, S for sport and then off again. And then you have your lane keeping located here. A couple of cup holders. The armrest opens up. There's lots of room in here and you've got a 12 volt down below. Put pretty much anything in there. 12 volt and 110 outlet. You also have a locking glove compartment. And then auto dimming, rear view mirror, lighting controls, sunglass holder, universal garage door opener. You have the sliding back power window, and then you have the power moonroof. And this also has a screen, so you can control the light and air. And then there's a grab handle in the body. That just makes it easier to 20 get. 20 inch wheels, mud flap, magnetic colored running board, body colored door handle with intelligent access, meaning when the fob's in close proximity, you can lock and unlock the doors, and you have keyless entry keypad. Driver's side, capless, easy fuel gas filler. And this has a sport badging on it because you have that center console and the body colored bumpers, and that's part of the sport package. In the back, you've got the body colored handle for the tailgate. The tailgate is lockable and removable. And below the handle is where your backup camera is located. To the right of it, uh, as I'm facing it, is where your LED light is. You also have backup sensors on your bumper four and seven pin connector, trailer hitch, and a locking spare tire. Nice thing is on your fob, you have the power release for it. So when you double click, it'll actually power down. And right now I may have locked things up when I closed it all up. You also have a tailgate step as well as a spray in liner and tie downs in all four corners as well as box link. And then when you're ready, you just close it up, lock it up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure. And on your fob, you have remote storage and speaker in the door as well as power windows. There's also a grab handle in the body and seating for three in the back with a 60-40 split. You simply lift the seat with one hand and it's in the upright position and then pull the clip to bring it down. There's anchors at the base to be able to tether baby seats and in the center an armrest with a couple of cup holders. On the floor, nice all weather mats, slim pockets on the back of the front seat. And in the center, you're seeing a couple of cup holders. You also have a 110, 12 volt, and the little red seats are the heated seats for back here and air vents on each side. 
Up top, that twin panel moonroof, you have hooks and lighting, and in the back, access to a power sliding window with rear defrost. Colored bumper, mud flaps, five and a half foot box spray in line box, as well, privacy glass in the back windows, blind spot information system and integrated turn signals in your side view mirrors, LED headlights, fog lights, tow hooks, and so many more reasons to visit us. If you like this video and would like to see more, please subscribe. We have plenty to share with you and we'd love to hear your comments.